everyone welcome back to my channel in this video i'm going to be sharing with you guys my top five favorite red lip colors some of you requested that i do this in the comment section of my previous top fives videos so i was like yes i'll do this i own quite a lot of red lipsticks if there's one lip color that i always gravitate towards it is red so i own quite a lot of red lip colors but i had to narrow it down to five i had to sit down and choose my absolute faves for this video because you guys wanted to see so this video is going to be all about that and for those of you who are wondering why does she need more than one red lipstick okay i will tell you why we have bright reds dark reds orangey reds blue tone reds it goes on and on you can never have enough red lipsticks because to me no two red lipsticks look alike they can be close but they are hardly ever the same so i'll be sharing my top five in this video so i've moved in a little bit because i want to swatch as i show you guys i have five lip colors like i said earlier but two of them are liquid lipsticks and the first three they are normal lipsticks so i'm going to start with the normal lipsticks first and then i will gradually move over to the liquid lipsticks they're going to be the last things that I'm going to swatch slash talk about but first I'm going to show you guys my favorite lip liners for red lips so the first one here is by MAC this is literally the first lip pencil that I ever got from MAC and this one is their lip pencil in cherry it's a true bright red lip liner and it is so easy to apply I don't even know how to explain the texture or consistency that you get with this it's not like the waxy crayony um, texture that you get with most lip pencils no this is actually very very smooth and it just glides on really 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 nicely you can actually get away with using this as a lip color by itself but then the problem with this is that it is too drying so it is highly unlikely they're going to wear this alone you might wear this alone and then maybe go over it with a gloss but i don't see anyone wearing this alone without having lips that look like really dry and chapped and then the second one the one that i normally use for like my darker deeper red shades is this one by nyx and it's in their shade it for it for it for green it for oh my god and it's in 844 deep red it's a darker red than cherry is it's not that dark like it's not the darkest red lip pencil that you ever come across but you guys can see that it is slightly darker than cherry is cherry is more like a blue tone red lip pencil i guess and this one is like a true red but a dark true red and another thing is that this one is obviously cheaper than the mac lip pencil obviously like mac is really high end this one is not i got this um when i was in the us i think two years ago and it sold for three dollars fifty that's how cheap it was whereas the mac lip pencils are slightly like more expensive i'm not sure how much they sell in dollars now i'm going to try and put the price somewhere in this video but i called the nigerian mac store and i was told that cherry is currently selling for eleven thousand five hundred, which is just like it's hilarious because i know when these things were selling for five thousand naira two years ago two years ago this time in 2015 you could have easily gotten this lip pencil for five thousand so for those of you who don't really understand why i'm saying this nigeria is currently in a recession so prices have doubled everything is just ridiculously expensive but if you live in the states or wherever just you can check how much mac is selling for in your country i wanted to get these two lip liners out of the way so the first lip color on my list is a lippy sticks by ColourPop, and it is in the shade bossy it's a very very bright red they describe this as a blue toned red which i think is true the thing to note though about ColourPop's matte lippy sticks they, they describe them as matte but in all honesty i don't think that they are matte the finish that you get with them is more comparable to max amplified finish they are not like you know flat matte no gloss that's not how you that's not how they look after you've applied them they have a little bit of sheen to them so i'm just going to quickly line my lips with max cherry because this is the lip pencil that i like to pair with this and then i'm going to come back and show you guys what they look like i'm actually going to swatch this on camera but i'm going to fast forward everything okay <laughs> So this is what bossy looks like you guys can see that it's like a true red It's a blue toned red and like i said you can see that this is not like extremely matte like the way that most matte lip colors we get these days would look this is you know the formula is said to be matte on their website but it has a very slight sheen to it and this is literally a steal it sells for five dollars and color pop lip colors are amazing for the type of quality that you get with them so this sells for five dollars on the color pop website and i know that they deliver to nigeria i'm not sure i haven't placed an order on their website 
website to have it delivered here before but then i have heard that they deliver to nigeria but then if you don't want to order it from their website i know that there are a couple of nigerian retailers that sell color pop i for one got this from a website a nigerian website called beautyspot.co.com .co.ng. I think beautyspot.com.ng I'm not sure but you can also get Colourpop lip colors from Nail Cosmetics as well just go on Google and search Colourpop products in Nigeria a couple of websites will just pop up those of them that have these kind of things in stock so yeah this is one of my faves I love the way that it looks the next one is another lip sticks by Colourpop and this one is in the shade Bitchet. You guys have seen me use this a lot here on this channel. I even had it on in my last Ankara Inspire tutorial. This was the lip color that I used and it is described as a deepened, deepened, deepened you guys know what i'm trying to pronounce right it is described as a deepened red i guess but it's more of like a dark red i'll describe this as a dark red so this is what it looks like i like to pair it with my nyx um, lip pencil in deep red because the colors are similar so i'm going to go on ahead and line my lips with this and then apply this So this here is Bichette. This is what it looks like. You guys can see that it is a darker red than Bossy was. I absolutely love this color. This is my go-to lip color whenever I want like a dark red lip. This is the color that I go for. And my favorite thing about Colourpop lip sticks is, I don't know the plural way to say lip sticks, okay? But my favorite thing about these things is that they are so creamy so pigmented like they don't dry out your lips they are just like gorgeous looking lip colors if you're sleeping on the color pop um lippy sticks is i'm sure that that's probably not how it is said but if you're sleeping on these please don't sleep on them these colors are so pigmented and they glide on smoothly this is my go-to dark red shade and it's color pops bitches so the third and final lipstick on this list is Max Ruby Woo. I think that these days, some of us like to pretend that we don't know who Ruby Woo is. Before every other red lip color that we know now, there was Ruby Woo. That was the go-to for a lot of us. It was the go-to red lipstick for a lot of us. I've not seen a lot of people using it as much again of late, but this lipstick is still big. It's a very, very matte red lipstick, especially for a lipstick that comes out of a tube. And it is, you have to really moisturize your lips before you use this. So before I ever apply this, I always go over, no, go on the, no. English, Konumo. Yeah, over my lips first with... Maybelline's Baby Lips, the blue one. I really love this one. This is the Hydrate, the blue one. This one doesn't have any kind of color payoff to it. And then I go in with Ruby Woo. It's a very, very matte blue toned red. That is what MAC describes it as. So I'm going to go on ahead and line my lips with Cherry. And then I'm going to apply this. So this is what ruby wool looks like you guys can see that it's a very very vibrant really really vibrant red and i absolutely love this lipstick it's a lot easier to apply than most of the matte really really matte liquid lipsticks that i own so in a situation where i want to go somewhere especially to a place where i know that i'll be doing a lot of talking or maybe a lot of eating and i want a very matte red lip i wouldn't go for a liquid lipstick i'd rather go for this because it's a lot easier to reapply this and still maintain the type of finish that you want than it is to reapply um, a liquid lipstick if that makes any sense the fourth one is the liquid lipstick by Gioni cosmetics and if you've been following me for a while like as far back as of let's say 2014-15 you will know that there was a time that i used to use this a lot i've used this in one of my Ankara inspired tutorials i had this in a favorites video i use this quite a lot and i got it from a nigerian retailer i can't remember what their name is i think that i got this for around three five i'm not sure what the price is i'm also going to link that somewhere but this i got from a nigerian retailer i remember that after i used this on my channel a few times people started asking me where they could get this especially people who did not live in nigeria talking face is yes that's the name of the store that i got this from i tried looking online to see if there was a way that people who lived in the u.s could get this a website comes up but then I'm not sure that that website works properly, but I'm still going to link it somewhere here in case you're interested in trying to find this. It says Journey USA, so you'd assume that this is a US brand and it's going to be really easy for people in the US to get their hands on it, but that's, that, that's not really the case. I think that the retailers that sell this in Nigeria, they get this from the UAE. They get this from Dubai. I, and I really, really suspect that that is where they buy this from. So if you're in the Middle East, you might have better luck finding this than people who live in the US and the UK. But I 
I love this lip color. It's a very, very vibrant blue toned red and it lasts all day. This thing does not budge. It lasts freakishly long. It's a little bit scary how long it lasts. And getting it off is a problem. So I'm really, really like worried about getting it off to apply the last liquid lipstick that I have on this list. But this, this is amazing guys. They call it a long lasting lip gloss, but this is a liquid lipstick. But the full name is the Gianni USA Long Lasting Lip Gloss in the number LLG18. The last lip color on this list is a liquid lipstick by Dose of Colors and it is in the shade Kiss of Fire. I've used this before in a tutorial here on this channel, but this liquid lipstick is absolutely gorgeous and it is very very similar to the other liquid lipstick that i just showed you guys the journey one so if you're in the us or in the uk and you can't get your hands on the journey one consider getting this one this one is it's really really gorgeous i'm going to quickly apply this and then i'm going to show you guys what it looks like One of my really favorite things about this liquid lipstick is the doe foot applicator that it comes with. It curves at the tip to accommodate the shape of the lips, which I think is really amazing. A lot of liquid lipsticks don't come with this type of applicator, so I'm glad that it comes with it. So that's basically it for this video. Every time you see me wearing a red lip color, it is definitely going to be one of the five that I just showed you guys. So you guys should let me know what else you'd like me to do a top fives on. I have an idea of some of the things that you guys want to see next based on previous requests but don't hesitate to leave a new request in the comment section of what you like me to do a top fives on next okay i'll see you guys in my next video